guys, guess what? I get to go to the gym today. Finally. I'm so excited. Woo! Oh, also, this is my first time vlogging today, so welcome back to the vlog hey. channel. We are about to head to the gym. It is 4.20. We should be home about 6.30, so exciting. Feels so good to be back. I'm about to get on this treadmill, try to accomplish a mile, walking or running, whichever. But I'm gonna get it done.
Okay guys, so I just got out the shower. Brian killed me at the gym. So you guys didn't see all of our workouts. So after we both did the row, we went back to the cardio room. The first room you guys seen me walk into, we did the dips, pull-ups, and the ab machine in there. And then we ran another half a mile. So yeah, that was it. But I wanted to talk about this brush. I told you guys about this in my last video. And just, if you have curly hair, like get this brush, like look at this. Like this is exactly what I wanted and what I needed. And it pulls out a very little hair, you guys. Like, look at that. Such, like very little hair. And I am done brushing my hair. So yeah, I'll link this in this video and it's linked in my last vlog, but try out this brush. So, yeah, I just finished showering my skincare and stuff. Now, you guys hear Juicy Jazz in the background. So, now it's just going to lay down. I started a new book on, I think over the weekend I started this book. So, I finished Holy Hustle. A book review will be coming on that soon. I finished Holy Hustle last week. A review on that will be coming soon. Now, I'm starting this book. This book is good. I wish it was more devotional like like Holy Hustle, but if you can really grasp and hold on to what you read, this book is pretty good. So, If you need devotional style, go with Holy Hustle. If you don't feel like doing all the extra writing and reading, try out this book. But we are about to call it a night now, so see you guys in the morning. Good night. Hey guys, good morning. So I woke up at about 6.30, got out of the bed at 6.37. I'm about to straighten my hair. I didn't really do a workout today. I just did a stretch video because I burned way too many calories yesterday that I wasn't able to replenish. So I did a 20 minute workout this morning, got up, took my supplements, did all of that jazz. So now I'm just going to watch some videos and straighten my hair. And I feel like that's something you guys never really see. So. Just thought I'd bring you along for the ride, you guys. <laughs>
in the bed a little bit longer than I should have because now I'm running behind. Oh, seven o'clock. I'm barely about to take my stuff so I can work out. So I won't be able to work out till 7.30. But that's okay. I can get some work done between now and then. So, yeah. I'm about to take my um, CLA and green juice. Gotta take King back to his room because for whatever reason, him and Ethan woke up crying at like 6.25 right before my alarm went off. But, um, yeah, they woke up crying and I was just like, what <laughs> the heck? Hey guys, so it is lunchtime today. Uh, yeah, Ethan had lunch. I made the boys corn dogs. I'll give them a snack in a second because I meant to give them chips while they were eating, but I was recording and now Ethan's class has started. So I'll get them some chips in a second and take them to them. But I'm about to get dinner in the crock pot because a friend wants me to go to church with her tonight. It's really going to depend on what time we get out of the gym, but I do want to go. So that's why I'm throwing dinner in the crock pot just in case I'm able to go. Brian, all Brian has to do is drop me off, come home feed the boys what's in the crock pot so it's gonna be slow cooker parmesan chicken and rice so i'm just gonna go ahead and start doing that you guys So the recipe didn't call for green beans, but I was like, what the heck, why not? It also called for Lipton onion soup seasoning. Don't know what that was, so I just seasoned it myself. 
and called it a day. <laughs> but um, yeah, I just needed something that had rice, veggies, and a meat. So that is gonna be our dinner tonight. Oh crap. Also, I forgot to sprinkle this on top, but you just sprinkle one fourth cup of grated Parmesan cheese on top. Okay, so yeah, you sprinkle grated cheese on top. It says on high for four hours. I don't need it done in four hours. So I'm gonna look up some crop pot conversions and see what the time would be if I cooked it on low. I'm pretty sure that's like six to seven, we will see. So yeah. thing that I showed you that dinner was okay but it wasn't anything special if I make it again I definitely will buy the onion soup the Lipton onion soup pack soup seasoning pack mix thing that they suggest that you use with it and I think it might come out a little bit better but yeah it wasn't anything special but I think it's because I was missing that one ingredient um today is Friday doing my reading and I also got a wash sheet. I'm still currently debating on if I want to work out or not. I might just do like a 30 minute one like I did or 20 minute one like I did yesterday. Still not sure. But yeah, I'm about to do my reading and then by the time I'm done with my reading, I will know whether or not I want to work out. And I didn't really vlog yesterday because even Wednesday night or Wednesday before we even got to dinner, I was just feeling really sick and I took a really long nap. My stomach was cramping up and everything. Now I did start my period on Monday, but I don't know, just my body's been off this week. And so I'm just been like, I don't know. And so even yesterday, I just kind of felt sick all day, headache, things like that. So I didn't do much of anything yesterday. I just edited and got a video up also, you know, but you guys know Ethan's home doing school. So helped him with school. And then unfortunately his school, I guess fortunately unfortunate, like his school pushed the open date back to the 14th. It was supposed to open up next week on Tuesday, but they pushed it back another week. And so this mama just needs all the prayers for grace and patience because it's not so much Ethan. I mean, it's like a com combination of all the boys. Like they're just crazy right now. The other two want Ethan to get up and play with them. Ethan wants to go play. Ethan can't go play. Ethan gets distracted. The other two get into things. And this mom has just been all over the place. So 
yeah so that is the reason why this week's videos um have been like that i've uploaded have been off and uploaded at different times and that i just haven't been able to i don't know like gather myself if that makes sense so yeah i'm gonna do my reading and writing right now and then i'll see how i feel about working out when i'm done So I just I just finished my reading, so I need to post this on Instagram. If you don't follow me on Instagram, you should because I always post encouraging, funny things on there. So yeah, I gotta post a picture of this on Instagram saying good morning. And yeah, I think I'm just gonna do a stretch video today. Maybe a 10 minute workout and a stretch video, or maybe just a 10 minute workout. Probably just a 10 minute workout. <laughs> so yeah, you guys. So I'm about to wrap up this reading. And then I'm about to change and then do a 10 minute um, workout and then get dressed for the day. So, yeah. Okay, guys, so I decided to do a 30 minute workout because that's what she posted today. So I'm going to go ahead and knock that out and then I'm going to get dressed for the day. And I want to record a fall makeup tutorial. It'll probably be a voiceover. Maybe. We'll see. Probably. Hey guys, so I don't know if I talked to you guys before or after my workout when the last time was that I talked to you guys. I still want to film my fall makeup look. I just found out, though, I just found out that Mrs. Myers has fall scented candles Excuse at Target. What, oh, baby? I made a bone. It's not a bone. Yes, it is. It's crust, but it looks like a bone. No, can I put this in trash? Yes. So yeah, I just found out... Sorry, y'all, that's better. I just found out a local car wash here in Lubbock is doing free car washes for all red and black cars because our um, the university we have here is Texas Tech and the colors are red and black. So all red and black cars are getting a free car washes. But, oh, I was talking about the candles. So <laughs> I want to go get some fall scented candles from Mrs. Myers, and they have them at Target. So I do want to do that. Brian has a draft party he has to go to tonight, even though he just went to one last night for work. Now he's doing one with the guys at church. So it's just like, oh, my Lanta. But, yeah, I would really like to get the car washed and go to Target and look for some candles. And maybe I could do that by myself whenever he gets home from work and use that as some me time because as we've learned, 
your girl needs some me time. But for right now, it is 11.44, so Ethan starts school again at 12 from his lunch break, and I am just editing today's vlog. So that probably won't be up till about two o'clock, three, hopefully. So I'm actually, I actually did a really long detailed cook with me in this vlog for, I don't know, it's tacos, but I don't know. You guys said you like to cook with me, so doing more cook with me style vlogs. But yeah, um, gonna film at some point. I really do wanna do that fall look, so. We shall see if it gets done today, but I did at least fix my hair and get, ooh, cleavage. But I did at least fix my hair and get decently dressed. So I decided to wear olive green today or army green today because apparently Texas hasn't gotten the memo that it starts to need that it needs to start cooling off. Like Texas is just not with the program. And then new nail color because September, right? How fall are these nails? I also want to find some more fall colored nail polishes. So maybe I could do that today as well when I go to Target. I don't know. Who knows? I want to go to Target today. I for I already forgot what time Brian's football party starts, but we just got the kids hanging out. I think Bryson's in his room on his tablet. And yeah, they just ate pizza. I need to find me something to eat. Anyways, I'm going to finish editing this food part on the vlog. And then I'll see you guys in the kitchen for something to eat. Today is Friday, so I'm going to try to vlog a little bit more. Because this week's vlog ain't got much footage at all. Like, there's even some footage that I'm not even going to show. Because it's, like, pointless. Like, me saying good morning and stuff like that. So, yeah. Today will be more vlogging done. I'm ready to take a break. Alright, y'all. So... For lunch, I'm eating these tamales. Brian got them from Walmart, I think, like in the frozen section. And I don't know, I guess I'm just gonna try these out. They said to heat them up for two minutes. I heated them up for four. I don't know. I guess because I heated up two of them. They're pretty fat, so I don't know. This is what I'm having for lunch. Probably gonna drink some kombucha and yeah, so we shall see. All right, you guys. Mama. These little Walmart store bought tamales Mama. are bomb. And I mean Mama. bomb. Okay. And now we're so. going to click on code. Now Ethan now has to finish his work. But I just have to say that these little things right here are bomb. And I'll have to show you a picture of the box. But man, these little tamales are good. Oh, and yes, I eat my tamales with ranch. <laughs> Okay, so these are the tamales that I ate that are super good. This is just what the box looks like. Brian chose the shredded beef one. <clears throat> now, I swallowed something the wrong way because your girl has some burning in her throat. I just had to bleach down my sink because the ants were out again. Just ready for fall i'm so ready to move somewhere where seasons are a thing and fall like there's no bugs like is there a place that exists without bugs king why are you so loud little cuties and then ethan is still in his technology class he is learning coding today so yeah hey guys so it is now eight o'clock I met up with my friend and went to Target at 5.30. And then I was there for about an hour, came home, and then, but I did pick up a couple things. I already scattered it around the house. So I'm gonna just show you guys. So the first thing I picked up was this little pumpkin. It was $3, so I put, decided to put that pumpkin there. And then I moved my little fall flower arrangement to my desk, which you will see in a minute. And then wine, because relaxation. <laughs> And then I did buy two of these Mrs. Myers candles. These are their acorn spice ones. They smell so good. I was getting so sad because I did not know. I made this switch last year after fall to essential oils. And I was so sad because I didn't know what I was gonna do for fall scents. But Mrs. Myers got me on that. So I remember I was gonna show you guys, King has been in this pumpkin so we just leave that facing that way but this is like the table arrangement for fall and then i 
you guys seen I have this little section right here it's a little family friends football and then I have hello fall I have another little arrangement that I made down here and I've had that vase I just bought everything that's in it from the Dollar Tree and then I believe I got that from Target so now we're gonna head to the room so I can show you guys what else I got from Target. Another Mrs. My the other Mrs. Myers candles I bought is in here, and then this was the fall flower arrangement. I moved to the room just so that way for the background of my videos we got some fall going on. I also want to buy a couple of fall things to put up on the wall. Okay, and then this is where oh, all the money went. But guys, um, this is, you guys probably won't see it inside, but in time. But Target had a Labor Day sale, so all of their kids' clothes was 20% off. So I didn't pay more than 7 bucks for anything. So Bryson really needed clothes, so I bought him this shirt right here. Sorry, I'll just dump it out. So I got him that shirt to go with these pants right here. And then I bought him this shirt because my poor baby, he didn't have no 3T clothes. He sprouted it right in front of our eyes but he's not big enough to fit in ethan's old 4t clothes so we had to go get him some 3t clothes but like i said i didn't pay more than seven bucks for anything so then i got him this one right here to go with these pants you guys bryson all my kids are my little fashionista so yeah i'm excited to see and actually go through to see what else he's gonna need but I did pick him up quite a few shirts. Like I said, he was really needing fall shirts because I'm pretty sure I can pass down some of Ethan's sweats to him from the last couple of years. So then I bought him this shirt. And then just a plain gray flannel. Ethan, please stop. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. And then I got him this shirt right here because he has these um, vans that he don't really have much to wear with them because he doesn't Mom, have a lot of red. Mine. No, this is Bryson's. Oh, did he shine so, lights? No, this is all Bryson's. I'll show you yours in a minute. So yeah, this is yeah, all. This one. Yeah, so I'll show you in a minute. So yeah, I bought him this shirt because he has these red vans that he doesn't get to wear much because he doesn't have much red. So yeah, I just got him three blue <laughs> shirts just to we got to buy him a couple pairs of jeans and a couple pairs of sweats. But other than that, my baby is getting his little collection up so yeah after i just like for them to have at least two pairs of pants like that um and i didn't like that most of their pants were joggers so that's the only reason i got him only two of those and then for king i picked up these black pants because he has tons of jeans and a pair of khakis so i just went ahead and picked him up some black pants so you could have another like shirt to another pair to wear with like dress shirts and then for Ethan, I did pick him up a couple of long sleeve shirts because he still has a few from last year that should fit him okay. Um, so yeah, this is his uh, one of Ethan's shirts that I got him. I just liked this shirt and it was one of their cheaper ones and didn't have much on it. So I really liked that. And then I was just in love with this shirt. Ethan, don't touch it. I just really feel like this shirt kind of yelled fall, but also like it has a good saying on it. Like give thanks so that is it that i got i'm probably gonna put a cartoon on for them in the living room and then i'm gonna go in their room and sort out all their clothes separate the clothes see what needs to get booted to the trash and then see what needs to get passed down and go where so is that coco melon yep okay so yeah, I'm probably about to go to their room and go through all of their clothes. But I am going to go ahead and just end this vlog here, you guys. I'm sorry this vlog's been kind of boring. But always remember, if you haven't already, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Also, hit that subscribe button. And I will see you guys in on Monday. Bye. Mwah.